Whose adventure is this? Joe Star dies. Jojo dies. Who's next? Mojo Jojo. It's gonna become my adventure. Am I Jojo? It's like how many licks does it take to get to the center of a tootsie pop? No, no, that doesn't even matter anymore. How many Jojos does it take to go on a Jojo's bizarre adventure? That's my type of story. I just got back from Disney World. I need a perfect way to inject anime into my veins, and I don't know any other better way to do that than to just watch Jojo. I feel like it'll get me back into the anime spirit. All right, my fellow Jojos, because I feel like we're all Jojos at this point. Let's just get to the show. Welcome to season two of Jojo. Jojo, Jojo, Jojo. Jojo is going to be a, a great, great grandfather by the end of the series. I'm completely convinced. What do you, what do you Who's this now? Who's this? I know it ain't Jojo's dies. <laughs> All right, you know, I was just joking about the whole great great grandfather thing, but we we we, we took Vinland Saga's time jumps and we said, Sit down, pussy, because we just did like a 50 year time jump. Get so cat. Oh my god, speed wagon. Are they speed running the show? <laughs> Oh, yeah, this is Jojo, all right. Oh. 49-year time jump. We already have a Tom Petty successor. Jojo's child. It's in his fucking 50s now. Oh, my hair is standing on end, all right. I'm never going to be surprised about a Vinland Saga time jump ever again after what I just witnessed. I have a feeling... We're going to be a hundred years into the future by next week. And we're back to the mask. Those are all the Jojos, aren't they? I don't even know. Right. We're in fucking New York, bro. We're catching up to modern day New York. We're going to be there by the end of the week. I guarantee it. Is that Poco? Is that Porco? Whatever the fuck his name is. Or is that Porco's son? It's probably his son. Coca-Cola. It's Coca-Cola. My favorite! Can this guy decide what hair he wants? Why'd you take his, his wallet? This guy's still stealing shit? Is this Porco son? Did, did he learn from his father? There's no way this is po Poco. What, what the hell is his name? Pablo? This is definitely New York. The pigs. It's the feds. Yup, New York. Yup, yup, yup. This is New York. You're mad nice, bro. I thought you were gonna answer 30. 20? You're really nice. Who is this? This is JoJo 4. 4.0. That's definitely a JoJo. Definitely. Why does he look like Dio? Like a crossbreed between Dio and JoJo. Like if they fucked. Oh. I feel like I've just entered the Matrix. Or some shit. Or I entered the Twilight Zone. Bro. What are you doing? <laughs> He's even doing the poses. This is definitely the offspring of JoJo. Ah! You better step back! Uh. We need this guy in New York immediately. This is what you do to the pigs when they fuck with you. Learn. I endorse it. <laughs> he has Coca-Cola in his hand. He's gonna flip the cap at him. Oh my god, he's gonna catch the bullet. What the? Oh my god! Granny Arena! I was joking! So, wait a minute, wait a minute. Arena had a child. And that child is, is basically Joe Star. Jojo's like Jojo's father for the first episode. So now this guy is basically the new Jojo. I, oh my god. 
His grandpa died in the war. Well, what? What? I made up. Oh, hello, Smokey. Joseph. Joseph. Hello, Joe Star. I'm not gonna get attached to you because there's probably ten more JoJo's after you. So pop your Coke bottles. Or two. Okay. Hey. Every part you get three, four JoJo's. You could call me JoJo. Oh my god. This is definitely the Twilight Zone. So Dio's alive somehow too, right? I wouldn't even doubt it at this point. He was a fucking floating head in the last episode. 13 years ago. What, what is he, 70 here? Yep. Yep, this, this is anime, man. Alright, let him read his fucking manga in peace. Oh God. It's like PTSD. How many JoJo's has Speedwagon seen died? Grandma Arena. Oh my god, yes. Keep the music consistent. Make it better and better. This is what I need. He ripped the plane seat. Or the helicopter seat. Out of the fucking socket. I mean, that doesn't even surprise me. Well, why am I letting it surprise me? Oh. Oh, they just Joe, he, he grew wings out of his fucking back. That's, that's how they landed. They used his biceps as a spring. When he used his biceps to fly out the plane, that's when I realized he's JoJo's offspring. Oh, okay. He passed down his avatar blood. What the devil? This guy's creating a backstory. Or like a whole arc. For, for, for Jojo. What, what the fuck is his name, man? I, 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 okay, every every time I mention Jojo's name, I'm talking about the current Jojo, okay? Unless I say Jojo 2-3, I don't know anymore. How am I gonna do this? How am I Jojo the third? Or is he the fourth? I don't even know anymore. No! No! You're gonna kill him now? You couldn't kill him off screen? Oh, he's alive. Okay. I've seen heads float and talk. So nothing should, should, should worry me. Oh my god, I like this new animation they've been introduced. I secretly admire Dio, of course! Ooh. Oh god, Dio's back. You should have destroyed the mask 60 years ago, Speedwagon! Man. Man, I told you about Dio. He probably has a floating finger still alive, roaming the lands. Oh no! Back to New York. All right, so Hot Wheels is dead. JoJo's dead. Like, like our JoJo from episodes one to nine. He's dead. Who else is dead? Where the fuck is Poco Porco? Why does he look like a fucking fire hydrant now? This guy has a very unique voice. Who's that? Arena? Oh, it's Arena! Damn, she's looking a little sexy now. Taxi! <laughs> Taxi! It's like everything is Japanese and then Taxi! <laughs> is that fancy? Taxi! Let's grab it! Taxi! Oh no no no! Don't you dare play this music! Oh, no. Finally a black person! Jesus Christ, man! 
Y'all telling me like Poco, what was his name? He's black. I didn't even know they didn't, they didn't show it good enough. Now, now you can tell. Here we go. This is what I want, bro. We're in New York. We better see some black people. How do you do that without opening his mouth? Damn. Yeah, Arena! The Joe Stars were short lived. Yes, I know. Oh, we know. That's so beautiful. Oh, oh! I gotta like create a family tree. I need to JoJo family tree. But I'm afraid to look it up at this point because it'll be spoiled. The family tree will be the size of the Deku tree from Legend of Zelda. That's how big it's gonna be. So, I'm not even gonna look that up. Jojo 1, Jojo 2, 2 3, 4, 5, 1 to 100. He has a bomb on his head? What kind of must- <laughs> What is this guy implying? I'm afraid, where is this going? When protecting your friends, put your hand on your face. <laughs> yeah, I want to see Granny's ham. Wait, do I? Oh shit! Arena, I like. Oh god, she's a milf. I knew it. This is the best depiction of New York I've ever seen. Yo, this funky music. Masaka is right. <laughs> I, I guess he could predict the future. He knows the dialogue. It's Manga Man. <laughs> How do you know what I was about to say? Oh. Yes, this is Manga Man. He's read it before. He knows everything. Even in the manga, he read the manga. Exactly. Listen, I just went to Disney World. I thought I saw some crazy shit there, but like this takes the cake, man. It's like I went from from being high on on, on positivity at Disney World, and now I'm just on like LSD or something. You know, it's like you, you just you were overdosed with happiness and positivity and Mickey Mouse doing fucking jumping jacks. And now I'm here watching this. I, I'm going to need like like a break for a week. I, I'm going to need a, a, a dose of negativity to hit me to balance out the positivity and crazy shit that I'm witnessing lately. <laughs> oh, this is why we came here. Yeah. Uh Oh, the real boss. <laughs> Damn, Arena has that resting bitch face, and I'm kind of turned on. No, don't, don't even talk about it. Don't talk about Hot Wheels. No! A monk. Oh, shit. Look at that. Look at that, man. His thighs could compete with the fucking table at this point. There's a separate battle, his thighs. They're gonna detach from his body. Oh, you're gonna confront the monk, and then you're gonna die by the end of the season, and your your grandchild's gonna be the next main character. This is really interesting to me right now. If they keep this shit up... Oh, okay. Okay. Yep. Or just do that. I can never say a full sentence in the show without something... Somebody punches somebody. How dare you upset grandma? Let's just fuck up the restaurant. It's a cycle. Grandma. Granny! Oh, we know your fate. You're a Jojo? I know your fate. I don't even gotta watch the rest of the season. Oh, I still have never been there, and I've lived here 27 years of my life. It's like, am I am I on Earth? Is this real? Is this a real conversation? After what we just watched, 
We were literally fighting to the death on a boat, a floating head on the last episode. The boat exploded. I thought the ocean was going to explode. We time jumped 80,000 years. Arena is a grandmother. The grandchild looks like a fucking floating, uh, 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 souped up steroid fire hydrant. Now they're talking about titties. Oh, yeah? What the fuck did this OST? Whoa, where did this come from? Oh, is he about to die? Is he about to die? You, you know what, man? You know what? Now I expect everybody to die. I'm telling you, we're going to be in 2023. By tomorrow. By the end of this episode, perhaps. Why are you... Why are you poking the bear? I believe you! <laughs> what's in this drink? What, what's in this? I, I, it says bang. May, 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 maybe there's something in this. What's? I gotta look at the ingredients. He just pulled a courage to cowardly dog. You ever watch that show? It's a fucking little dog, and he pulls, like, a car out of his pocket. That's literally what he just did. I mean, with that body, he could hide out an apartment building under his jacket. <laughs> did you at least warn all these people that you had a fucking machine gun? Or is that a turret? That ain't a Tommy gun! Yeah. Only if I knew you, you had a, a fucking a turret for, from from an army base under your jacket. So you're telling me this is gonna get better and better? I'm I'm like I'm fucking flabbergasted at how entertaining this show is. And y'all said if I loved episodes one through nine, that scares you. Because now you're worried how much in love I am that I'm going to be after this episode. After episode 9, as the parts continue. I'm actually worried myself. You know what, man? I'm not even going to complain. The fact that they constantly change main characters is a good thing. Because that means we could continue to show forever and ever. I swear to God, I'm going to be telling my kids about JoJo the first. Or JoJo the second or the third. And they're going to be on JoJo the 40, 450th. You know what I mean? Like, we could continue this for a long time. JoJo can never end. This story can never end. This bizarre adventure. This is a fucking bizarre adventure, all right? This is going to last a lifetime. I'm going to pass my reaction channel down to my grandchildren. We're going to be reacting to JoJo until the end of time and beyond that. And, uh, and yeah, we're on part two now. I don't know what to expect. Except for another JoJo death. And maybe another three more JoJo's dying. So, um, I wonder how many JoJo's they'll kill this season. Bye.